we are today at the global launch of the Inventor Assistant Program. Uh, this is a program that had been launched in a pilot phase in three countries, Colombia, Morocco and Philippines. Nous accordons une importance capitale au capital immatériel et la, les inventions nécessitent qu'il y ait un suivi, bien évidemment de la part de professionnels, et ce programme apporte ce suivi qui est un maillon très important de la chaîne de l'innovation au Maroc. The main aim of the program is to help under-resourced inventors all around the world to get legal advice um, and, 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 and technical advice to navigate the patent system. And it relies on pro bono, free uh, assistance on the part of lawyers throughout the world or patent attorneys who assist inventors. As a lawyer, that it became the first pro bono lawyer in patent matters in Colombia. For us, it has been a great experience. For the first time, we are in contact with very, very creative people around our country and helping them to protect their innovations, their creation. Uh, among the sponsors, we have international organizations. We have corporate sponsors like Novartis and Qualcomm. And, and we have all the key players, uh, for example, the Federal Circuit Bar Association um, and the Latin American Patent Attorney Association. WIPO as the clearing house, main role is to match um, pro bono patent attorneys with inventors under resource that have been selected country by country, and we put them together in order to provide the, the advice um, and the relationship in between these two directly. Around a dozen of inventors have been selected and had, had access to the programs. We have around uh, 50 patent attorneys registered and they are uh, very operative. Uh. The role of the World Economic Forum is key since the beginning of the program and still today. It's, uh, we're at an important stage of this undertaking, which is moving from, uh, from that kind of conceptual phase to an, a model that can be implemented. And I think today is an extremely important uh, milestone in that regard. This program is about sending a message to countries. It's about sending a message to leadership. It's about sending a message to those who fund innovation that innovation is important, that there are people in your country who are making really great innovations that are so great, in fact, that they can travel through the patent system and be given um, official legal protections. It's about opportunity and creating economic opportunity and societal opportunity for people who have great ideas and just don't happen to have huge um, financial resources. There is no better time than today for expanding intellectual property systems to serve new inventors, to grow worldwide uh, innovation. The IIP does not merely provide people, uh, provide help to in inventors. It empowers them to leverage their own talents. It's my hope that the expansion of the IAP will create similar results around the world and give many inventors the recognition they deserve for their hard work. Well, my hope is that this program will eventually be global in scope, will serve innovators in all countries, and will ensure that in the patent system there is no invention left behind. We would like to see it spread to other countries so that there is a genuine support system for inventors and small and medium enterprises uh, in the intellectual property system throughout the whole world.